Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to generate Python documentation web pages from your Python source code. So in this tutorial, I'm going to use Spinex. I assume you already installed Spinex on your machine. In case if you have not, you can go to the description. A video link is given. You can go through the video and install the Spinex. So now I'm starting. Uh, so for this tutorial, I have created this directory on the desktop. You can do the same as well. And I am going to write my Python code in this directory. So let's write our first sample Python code. So what I have done, I have written a simple function and this function is returning a string. Welcome to Spinex. Now what I want, uh, I want to add documentation to this file and that documentation I want to be extracted automatically and web pages should be generated from out of that. So I'm saving this file with mycode.py and I'm saving in this same directory website. Now we are going to add our documentation. So whatever you want to show in your web pages you can add that content in triple double quotes this is also known as doc string and here you have to write in rst so what i have done that uh, this my code package will be shown as a heading and I'm just writing a simple description. Okay, now in order to document this function, uh, the format is you have to specify the parameters, type of parameters and their purpose. So here there is no parameters this function does not need any parameter but in case if there is so let's say there is some parameter how you're going to write you need to first specify the name of parameter and then you have to specify type of this parameter then you need to specify what this function return and you have to enclose this in triple quotes. If you want, you can write another function or classes. So the next step we are going to do, uh, you need to open your terminal and you need to go to the this, this directory website. How you going to do that? So let me show, just open your terminal and go to this directory by using cd command then you have to run this command spinx quick start here it will ask you for a lot of option if you don't know anything just keep pressing enter so here I'm going to write the project name. Author name you can write here. And one important thing here you have to write why because this automatic generation need autodoc extension. For rest of the thing you just keep pressing enter. So once this uh, thing is done, open your website directory and you can see a number of files will be generated by this command so these are the configuration file used by Spinex. next you have to run make html command so this command will generate the html pages so if you want to see just go to build html and open index.html so this is your default web page now what we want we want to show here documentation 
from our Python code. And for that thing, we need to change the index file. So open, open this index.rst. And here you need to write auto module name of your code, which is also in the same directory, my code. And then you have to specify that what you, uh, um, how the documentation will be extracted, whether it is for all of the function or classes present in this file or some particular. So in our case, we are uh, taking documentation for from all of the function or classes. Save this file. Uh, you need to open configuration file as well. And you have to uncomment these three lines. Now just run the command again, make HTML. and refresh your page so if you can see this documentation is extracted from your code automatically so this facility is actually very useful to generate documentation out of your api thank you very much for watching